Welcome back, everyone, to another five-minute match. Get to be white, yay. Let's try and get this 1248 rating a little higher. That's terrible. We can do better than that. Play this gambit. Uh, just one step with the pawn. Let's get my pawn back. Yes, he takes. That's common. Um... Let's be a little aggressive with my queen. I'll just get castled. Yeah, let's let's preserve my bishop. Now where to deploy this guy? Actually let's yeah, let's go a four first, maybe even a five, and then get this bishop out. Get both my bishops pointing towards his king. Mm. Where do my rooks want to be? You know what? No, let's just let's keep pushing pawns. See, he's not developed yet, so let's take advantage of this. I can't push. That's a free pawn. He's threatening that. I could push here. Play e4 and he takes uh, this ugly isolated pawn. So maybe I just place bishop c4 and threaten f7. That looks better, right? Isn't that a free pawn? Am I missing something? I mean, you'll get a pawn in this exchange somewhere, I'm sure. But yeah, I think I'll, I think I'll take this pawn. So he takes. All right, that's just another free pawn. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah, that's just a free pawn. Now I just get my rooks active. I feel like I almost want to double. Actually, I really don't... I, I like this pawn structure. It's solid. But with my dark square bishop, it's just kind of in my way. See, I'm up, what, two pawns? Maybe I'll, I'll go for like a pawn sack here to try and get active. Or is that not even working? <laughs> let's try and yeah, let's try get these pawns on white squares. Block this guy in. I don't think I can save that pawn, but I can. So it takes, takes. It's on a light square, but I can put pressure on it. Okay. I like that. I like getting rid of his bishop. The pawn's still kind of a liability. Being on a light square with my dark square bishop. this guy too. So let's just push. No, I can't lose that guy. Let's just defend him. Then if the knight jumps in. And I don't want the knight in there. I'm glad he didn't take advantage of that. C3 is a little weak. Okay, so he's just defending, looks like. Um. Man, 
I feel like I just want to keep pushing. I can force, maybe even connect it past pawns. Yeah, let's see. I have a minute left. Let's go. Let's get these pawns rolling. I can that would be with tempo. There's something better. Yes, there is. He if Okay, he cannot take that pawn. That pawn is immune from capture. If he takes, I get a free knight. He can't take my bishop because of back row issues. So let's give my rook extremely active here. That's a mistake. I think he's realizing it now yet. <laughs> All right, well, I'm up a minor piece. Let's just save this guy and push this pawn. Well, not so fast. Okay, I got oh, got to work faster than I thought. Crap. Um, I'll give up that guy just to exchange some rooks. If he takes, that's a mistake. So I should just win this pawn. Yep, I'll take it. And I'll try and push this guy fast. <laughs> push, push, push. Push faster. And this pawn I can take. I uh, gotta go faster. Um. Sack the rook. <laughs> I have no time. This is not good. No, nope, not time. Ah, ah, time. That was a good game, though. I mean, I lost, but I played the game pretty well. Just have to watch that clock. I don't know why I get so long time in five minute chess. I think sometimes I kind of overestimate how short five minutes can really be. That's unfortunate. Anyways, thanks for watching, everyone. We'll try again next time.